Hello, welcome to a brief overview of the features in Look Insight. We'll start off just with the general ability to move around a space. There are many other features which we'd like to show you and if you're interested in anything in particular just go onto our YouTube channel and watch a specific video for that feature. So the first thing is that we're able to move around. Yeah, This is a 360 panoramic site, but the important part about it is that it is a seamless flow of movement between one view and the next. Another element we have here is the ability to include video into screens within the space. These are in fact, in fact, YouTube links, which can be operated from the screen. Now, if we carry on and we move in a little bit closer, you can see that we have the ability to animate elements in the space. So we can move through a doorway now let's just look at a few other examples. Here we can see the ability to actually choose a product, an object in the space and find out about it just by clicking on that, that object. So if we look over here and we say, OK, I'm interested in this thing here. We move towards it and we instantly load a web page related to the object with information about it here. Um, we can find out more or look around that object. We can move to the next object in the room. and look in detail at that information. So we'll go to another website, give you an example of something else. Um, here we go. This is a furniture website. Now in this situation, we can look at how a product is described on Archie product, which is a general architectural resource. You can then view that product from another angle. OK, now let's have a look at the concept of virtual reality or alternate reality. In this case, we can change the environment from day to night and look around the space at different times of the day. We can also navigate, for example, going downstairs and we'll be taken down to the lower floor. We can incorporate lots of other types of information, including forms and contact details. For example, if you wanted to book this property, you can navigate using arrows and other types of navigation tools. You can also allow the program to play you a tour, which means it's an automated experience. So this is all happening without me doing anything. But unlike a movie, you can interrupt it at any time and go back and see what you've missed. We also incorporate the possibility to interrupt this tour or just continue with it later. Doors are no obstacle for us. We can move through to another environment. 
and find ourselves in a space where the pictures on the wall are actually digital images that we've superimposed. And we're in a position to edit those images and to move them around just simply like this, scaling and resizing them. So we can organize a gallery within our space. We also have the ability to buy products directly through the interface, making product choices and loading our shopping basket before moving forward, updating our shopping basket and seeing what we want to take home with us. There we are. Okay. We also have the ability to incorporate images and photography to juxtapose with the three-dimensional imagery that we have. In fact, there's an awful lot more that we could show you. And our suggestion is that you take a little time to look into the feature videos on YouTube, which will take you a little further within all of these different possibilities for a look insight. I hope this was at least an entertaining introduction to what we have to offer.